you want to add custom font but don't know how to do. In this video, let's learn how to boost your website's personality by adding custom fonts in PageFly. Firstly, let Access Uploaded Fonts Manager to upload your own font. Navigate to the PageFly dashboard. Select Extra Functions. Choose Manage in the Uploaded Fonts section to access this feature. Please note that PageFly already includes all Google Fonts, which do not require uploading through the Uploaded Fonts Manager. PageFly supports four font formats TTF, OTF, WOFF, and WOFF2. After you upload custom fonts, all fonts will be automatically converted to WOFF2 format to optimize the page performance in the live view. Now it's time to upload custom fonts. After accessing the uploaded fonts manager, click the upload font button to start adding your fonts. You can easily upload your fonts like this. When you see these status, it means your fonts have been uploaded successfully. To use the custom fonts, let's apply custom fonts in global style. After adding custom fonts in the uploaded fonts manager, please go to global styles here. Select the typography parameter by clicking on it, then proceed to the styling tab. Click the settings icon, choose uploaded fonts, select your fonts and confirm with the select button. Use the drop-down menus to assign fonts to the typography type. To apply a custom font style within Global Styles, simply select the element you want to customize such as a heading, body text, or button from the element section. I will choose the heading element and set the custom font for the heading one. The heading one comes with six HTML tags for the heading element. I will set for the H1 first. Then navigate to the Typography section under the Styling tab and choose the predefined custom font style you wish to use. You can apply custom font for H2, H3, and others. Don't forget to publish your changes by clicking the Publish button. Next, I will guide you how to use custom fonts in PageFly Pages. Click on the heading or paragraph that you want to customize. Head to Styling tab in the Global Styles dropdown. Let's select the font that you added before. I will choose the heading one. This heading has been updated to match the custom font that I uploaded on Global Style. Here you are using heading three, so it will use the custom font that you uploaded for H3. If you change to H2, the font will be automatically updated accordingly like this. Please note that after uploading custom fonts, you cannot use the custom font directly in the editor page. You must add the custom font in Global Styles feature, then apply in the editor page. This is the end of the video tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel to get more new video tutorials. These are other videos on our channel you also may need. Thanks for watching.